In the court system, justice is not always just. That's why they bring their disputes here. Real people, real problems, real revenge. Justice is eye for an eye. All my friends are here. It's me. I'm Kato Kalen. And today on Eye for an Eye, we have a dispute between two women that's guaranteed to get snippy. The plaintiff alleges her business has been taken by a shady salon owner who's comfortable stealing more than just clients. The defendant denies all the charges and thinks there are more than just a few kinks in her story. And she's nothing but a backstabber. I can't believe she stole all of my customers. I trusted her, but you know what? She's gonna pay today. She's just mad because I took all of her clients, but I'm gonna get my booth rental that she refused to pay. This is the case of the stolen salon. When both combatants are armed with blow dryers, who will be full of hot air? Only extreme Akeem can decide. Let's watch! All rise! Ramona G, you're suing Chantel Gonzalez for $210, and Chantel Gonzalez, you're counter suing her for the same amount, correct? Mm -hmm. All right, why don't we start off with the plaintiff? See, I used to work in her salon. Right. It's really a vagabond or whatever you want to call it, but see, first of all, I go, I come into work. All my customers. I'm going to work late. Oh my God! Sitting up in the dryer. You're cutting her off. She's sitting up. She's laying on the floor. She's laying on the floor. She's laying on the floor. Cut it out. Cut it out. She's laying on the floor. I don't do all so that. So you were working in her salon. Let me get this first. Yeah, straight. I was and then what happened? Salon. That's why so I own the salon. In the work. That's I why I own the salon and you don't. Shh. I was That's coming why I in own. late. She don't tell my customers. She tell them, come on, let me do your hair, because she not coming in today. That's a lie. I come in, That's all my lie. customers, they sitting over there on her side getting their hair. And I'm like, what's going on? Oh, we yeah, got you get there at 12 o'clock. She How you gonna die. stand? She a big Y'all worked in the same place. You stole her clients. That's what she All of them. She made the appointments, though. I sure did. I did. Back. Back you ain't giving one of them back. She can't okay. see. Okay. Okay. You ain't giving one of them back. Your turn is over. Her turn to talk. She can't Shh. keep the water on. All right. Okay. Your turn is over. It's my turn to turn the hot okay. water on. Okay. Ma'am, ma'am, ma ma what did I just say? Pay your rent. Pay your rent and I can. Okay. Pay your boo rent. Pay your boo rent. Cut it out. Cut it out. Pay your boo rent. We ain't in the ghetto. You need to pay your boo rent. Pay your boo rent. That's me. Get her. Get her. Now, I gave you an opportunity. These are the rules. You talk, and then she talks. Now your turn. Tell me about her. She make appointments for her customers to come in at 8 o'clock. When I get to the shop at 7.30, her customers are out there waiting. I let them in. 10.30, come. Kia, still like that. 10.30, come. Hey, hey, you still like that. Hey, get her. 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 You get her. 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 Calls, she still don't answer the phone. She calls me back. Uh, are my customers there? I say, yeah, they're there. When she walk in the door at 12 o'clock, they are all under my dryer. Yeah, they are under my dryer. So you, so you did her the hair because she wasn't there. They've been there since 8 o'clock. No, baby, because I have. I was late. I have people that told me that she told them I'm not Okay, shh. Why are you counter suing her? I'm counter suing her because I went on vacation Friday. And the booth rent is due on Saturday. When I come back next week, she have no booth runner. Her station is clean. She moved all her stuff I out. I needed and to not move my pay stuff. Her booth okay, let me, no Every Bam, let me see. Bam, let me see. You need rent. to try to pay your no, life. No, you tell Dave. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Wait, okay, wait, 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 wait a minute. Oh, oh, you are dying. Okay, you know you you're suing her for stealing clients. You're suing her because she didn't pay her rent on the booth rental. Okay, I think I got it. Okay, you come on the cage. Let me hear from you now. Woo. Boy, that took a lot to get out of it to find out what this was about. Tell me what you know about this. Well, I'm one of her clients, and the day that I went in to get my hair done, let's say, okay, she put the phone on her, she saved it to the side, you know, to let it process or whatever. So she goes and cuts on the water, and there's no hot water. No my hot head water. burning. I had to give her her she money had to my back. money back. Who, you know you turned her hot water back. off? You turned her hot water off? We, it was a problem that happened a month ago. No, 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 no hot water. No hot water. No hot water. Uh, I was broke. Okay. I even got 
gave them paper and they both run them back that way. Okay. They even gave them paper and they both run them back that way. I can't understand why. Yeah. 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 Now you Tell them how you do your house. That's what you do. Tell them how I grab your house. Tell them how I grab your house. Okay. Shh. Screw the hair. That I tell you. Well, listen. Listen, all your... I mean, okay, you got nice hair. Tell me about your hair. Okay, I'm one of the 8 o'clock appointments that she was talking about. All right. I go in. I had an appointment to go to. I had a prior engagement to go to that day. And so I call her, and she's supposed to be up there to do my hair at 8.30. She didn't come in until 12.45. First of so all, I have kids that I have to take Every Saturday, that's the same My excuse. child was sick. Every Saturday, come on, now, get off the game. Shh, shh. Tell them okay. I got to wear weeds. All right, wait. Hey, man. 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 Screaming like this when we say the quiet. She's got a point. If why should your clients be waiting? How can you blame her for doing because their hairs when I you're didn't at blame home? Her for doing their hair, what it was, I called and I explained to her that I was. But you're suing her for taking your clients. She didn't call my because every Saturday is the same thing with you. Every Saturday, I was paying. My children sick. No every water. Saturday, and I had to work on time. Day. Okay, is it true she didn't have hot water for a whole week? No, the hot water heater was broke for two days. I the gave hot water heater was broke. I yeah, gave her right, half yeah, of right. the booth runner back that week. She a lot. So what else am I to do? Okay, I gave her half of her booth runner back. What you got to do with this? You just. Okay. I think you just. I think you just want to come in there and yell. I think that's what you want to do. Okay. Okay. You ain't need her. Okay. You're out of control. You out of the cage too. Okay, and you're gonna direct it to me. You're gonna direct it to me. Okay, That's set that up. Water okay, what evidence you got? I need hey, the evidence. What's got, the evidence? This is the agreement that we made every week. Ten is due. Okay, you say she owes it for the booth. What else you got? Anything and else? I have where I went to her shop and I took. I went to her shop. She to took complain. this stuff. You see your you see your friend over there getting handcuffed? You, you want to get you handcuffed? Need to shut up. You need That's to going to you next. That's what you be doing in the morning when you. You turn around, look at your friend. You see your friend? You want that to happen to you? So she one at a time. Up. One at a time. What what? She came to a new shop that I started working at. The first week I'm working. For my rent. She comes up and down. Oh, I want my rent. I want my rent. I want my rent. I say, excuse me, you need to leave. So she will leave. So I'll do the appropriate thing. I go to the back to call the police. I come back. She done took my hair dryer. You took my her hair dryer? And my, she my, 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 my rent. But you know what? Tears. I took that cheese stuff, so took it to the pawn shop, right. thinking I'm gonna probably no. get my rent, thinking she, you know, got quality stuff. Girl, that stuff ain't worth $10. Oh, you give it out. That's why you ain't worth $10. I said, you got quality stuff. You bought it out of ghetto. That's what you need. That's what you need. You know, your big mouth will get you in trouble sometimes. You just admitted stealing her stuff and pawning it. I mean, come on, what's with you? So you want your, your money back for a week. You said she stole your stuff. You admit stealing her stuff and pawning it. You want money because she didn't pay you for the week. She haven't paid all, all right, I got it all. I'll be back in a second with my decision. Thank you. That's what you do. you Settle down. Settle down. I got a comment. Business card. The business card. 
I'm not trying to get funny, but all this could have been uh, resolved from the beginning. You're the beautician. It was your responsibility to call your own client. I called my nope, own client. Nope, nope. That's not no, what you I said. Didn't you you own, did not say I that. Said, no. Okay, hush said, and let no, me speak. You hush I, I and said, let me speak. Let her speak. You did not say that. Hey, no, you no, did not say that. Let, let her finish her thought. Let her finish her thought. I was going to be late. You called her. I'm a long way You never stated that you called your client. So whatever you got, you deserved. Then you Because you should have called your client. No, what, not I, her. what I got what? was an incomplete show that did not function properly. Judge Extreme Akeem, we need you now. You got to make a decision. Please. Coming up next. You both think you are the best hairstylist. If either of you talk during my verdict, then I'm going to ask the Sugar Ray handcuff. <laughs> uh, you sued for $210. You counted suit for $210. All right, before I start my verdict, if, if either of you talk during my verdict, then I'm going to ask the Sugar Ray handcuff them. Um, you sued for $210. You counted sued for $210. You both think you are the best hairstylist. You um, think you're the best. You think you're the best. You both brought witnesses saying that you're the best hairstylist. So I'm going to order a hair off. You're going to bring in someone, and you're going to bring in someone, and you're going to cut their hair. And I'm going to bring in a professional hair judge who's going to judge the winner. The winner will get the $210 and get to do to the other one anything they want to their hair. And also, the loser will have to be quiet for two days straight. That's justice. <laughs> parties argued their cases, and I do mean argued, to the point where Judge Extreme Akeem could not get a word in. Well, these bickering beauticians are going to have to let their scissors do the talking. I predict the fur is going to fly when you see the guinea pigs we use to be their customers. I thought the judge's verdict for us having a hair cut off was the perfect solution to solve this problem because Chantel cannot cut nor style any hair. Chantel, when this is all over and they crown me the queen of hairstyling, I'm going to show you once and for all how it really feels to be ugly because I'm going to cut your hair into itty bitty pieces. A good haircut is the haircuts that I give, me as an, a, pro a professional. Bad haircuts is what Ramona gives. Horrible, non-professional haircuts. I'm going to make her ball like she's made a lot of her customers. Ramona, I'm going to kick your butt in haircutting because remember, I'm the real professional, okay? So therefore, that license you have, trash it, girl, trash it. Chantal, Ramona. So good to have you in the salon. Have you ever done a two-minute haircut? Yes, plenty yes. of times. Uh-huh. Well, today you're going to do another two-minute haircut. Okay. And we have some special clients for you to cut. Hey, Big Sugar Ray, bring in the clients. Bring them in. Bring them in. Oh, here they are. Oh, guinea pigs. What the oh. hell? <laughs> what is that, Sugar Ray? That's Kato and Big Sugar Ray? Yes, Kato and oh, Big Sugar Oh, my gosh. Ray. Well, right you can have it. Which one you want? Uh, uh, Ramona's going to take Kato, the blonde. Kato the blonde. There he yeah, is. Come here, come here, Kato. Oh come here, Kato. All right, all right. All right, we'll put okay, the uh, apron on them and uh, start cutting. The time starts as soon as you put them in the chair. Good luck. Start clipping. Let's go over here, Big Sugar Ray. All right. You, because you know why? You know Whatever, what? Ramona. Just do your job. You used to cut guinea pigs anyway. So yeah. go ahead and do your job. Whatever. How many ball spots you have on that poor thing over there, Ramona? Yeah, you need to. My strategy for winning is very easy. I have a wonderful technique in how I cut each individual hair. Everybody hair gets cut different, and that's got that's my strategy for cutting hair. Yeah, you could. I'm gonna make you eat all of those words, Baldy. I've been asking all day, who were the clients? Who were the clients? Where are the clients? Where are the clients? And when they brought in those guinea pigs, I could have fainted because I didn't know what to do. But I took my professionalism and I worked it, okay? Ramona. I'm gonna give you a good cut. And when I get to Chantal, she will regret it. Maybe you should go working in a grooming salon. That's the only place you'll have a job at. 10 seconds. I'm gonna get Anna here in about five seconds. Four, Come on, three, two, two, one, scissors down. Do you believe Woo! that these 
They used to actually be. Uh, Hi, you look so cute now, girl. That's oh, they look great. Okay, well you're done, and I'm gonna bring Anna in now. But I love the way you spike Kato's hair. Anna, come on in here. Cute and big sugar ray doesn't look bald, but he doesn't. He doesn't look better. <laughs> now, Anna. Oh, this is a very tough decision. It is then, a tough decision. Why don't you yes, take a closer look? Uh, because they're uh, the cutest troublemaker. the way she did this. It's it, kind of a tapered shelf, huh? Yeah. It's even. Yeah. The other one's got a little bit of too low. Could be the style she went for. Oh, could be. But, but I, the judge. I think this is the winner. Cato and yep. Ramona. That's right. As always, tell him what. No, I you do not. Do no, but she might all. be getting a job at this salon. You never know. But Chantel, remember. Well, if she wants a loser. Now, listen, I'm, I feel bad because you keep calling her Baldy Locks. I don't think things are going to be looking good for you in a few minutes. Baldy! You get to cut her hair any way you like. We have a winner. That's right. Sugar Ray, put her in the chair. Come on. You got to get in there. I'm not going to do you like you're going to do you me. She's a you know what? You need you to just promise. let me know that I'm the best. Say it. Yeah, Say it again. I can't hear you. Do you like that? Whether it's on a guinea pig, a human being, a dog, a cat, even a cockroach. Learn your skills. I don't work on guinea pigs. I don't work on animals. And see, she probably won because she's used to treating her customers like animals. She cuts so much of their hair off, they'd be very unsatisfied. They decide that they want to come over to me. She needs to come down off that high horse and recognize who's the true, true professional in this industry. But this industry is not for you. So hang it up, sister. You're through. Ramona, what you did, that's minor, baby. Even with my haircut, my hair is still a whole lot more healthier than yours. And the reason so is because I know how to do hair. And it will grow back. And Ramona, I will get revenge on you. <laughs>